Guess what, agents? It's story time. So, back in 2018, I was working at Hulong Trans Global. There were, let's just say, some pros and cons to that job. In the pro column, they gave a high degree of latitude to conduct experiments without regards to morality or ethics. On the con side, they treated me somewhat like a prisoner, armed guards everywhere I went. In the end, I decided it wasn't very conducive to scientific creativity. But Ezekiel Calvin reached out and made me a better offer to work with the Niantic project. I told him getting me out of Hulong would be easier said than done. Zeke said that it should be easy enough matter to spirit me away from Hulong, but there was something that he wanted in return. He wanted me to take something from Hulong before I left. I said yes, of course. I assumed at first that it would be a simple matter of corporate espionage, but in the end, he wanted something more, um, hmm, far more baffling. I had a colleague at Hulong, Sarah, uh, uh, it doesn't matter, I can't remember her name anyway. There was a ring that Sarah wore every day. I did notice that. Somehow, Calvin knew about it, and it was that ring that he wanted me to steal. It, it was a tall order, but somehow I was able to slip that ring off Sarah's finger, maybe with a little, without her noticing. Later that day, an unmarked helicopter flew into Hulong airspace. They shot a grappling hook into one of the upper floors of the Hulong high-rise and literally extracted me. It was insane, scary, and exhilarating. In any event, while the chopper was en route to the Niantic Project facility, I had something of an epiphany. The first seeds of inspiration that would lead to the creation of the Ingress Scanner. I realized that in order for us to be able to effectively study XM, we had to have technology that would allow us to see it, to interact with it. Staring down at the Earth from that helicopter that day, it was as if I could see the portals of my own naked eyes. And by the time we landed at CERN, I knew what I had to do. I gave the silly ring to Calvin and I went off to work. At the time, he never did tell me why he wanted that ring. Why am I even boring you with all this information? Well, a few days ago, Calvin finally got around to telling me why he wanted the ring. He thinks it's a prime artifact. A prime artifact that allows a wielder to see XM portals. Can you imagine that? If he's right, then I didn't just imagine seeing the portals on my way to CERN that day. I actually did see them. Because Sarah's ring was in my possession at the time, and as you know, it probably does even more than that. I'm not saying that I made mistakes, I don't make mistakes. But given what we're learning about prime artifacts, maybe that was true. I'm not so sure who Sarah was, why she was in possession of a prime artifact, or why the prime artifact was left out of the Helvetica field test in September. Well, let's just say this. I wouldn't be surprised if we see the ring appearing as a tessera sometime soon. One day, Calvin's going to have to tell me how he knows all things he knows. Because one day, I'm going to make him.